Hello people. I'm going to show you how to put your Unity game online. Yes, it's doable without having any website or thing like that. And the uh, first thing I'm going to tell you do that. This tutorial was based on a tutorial made by made by Gibran Syed. I'll put the link in the description. You should check it out. This post so you have your unity game I can show you the game it's not something really uh, detailed but yeah you got this little guy that punches and when he punches this thing boom it's a little buggy but whatever and uh, you have got to build this thing you go to file build settings control shift P it's a, it's a shortcut and uh, you select the web player. If it's, for example, for Android, you gotta click on web player and click on switch platform. Now, about these little checkboxes right here, I recommend for none of them being selected. And um, when you're prepared, just hit run. Remember to add your all of your scenes there, and yeah, hit run. Build actually. You'll got to. You'll have to select one folder. I already did build it, but I can build it again. And bam. So in this folder, you can see the 3D Unity 3D file and the HTML file. Well, where it will be shown the game, as you can see. No, you might, as you might think, whoa, this game, whoa, it's online, it's already done. Well, not, no, not really, because if you see up here, the the URL or what this is called, it it's c dot users dot as meaning this is my computer. This isn't my computer, not really no, on the web. For that, we'll have to to go to Google Drive. So to do that. Um, you gotta have a Google account and just type Google Drive on the search thing. You enter the Google Drive, and when you are here, you may have to create a folder or not. Sometimes that folder is already created, a public folder. In this case, it's not, and I'll show you how to create, create it. So you go to create folder. And you call it something like game, game tutorial, <laughs> something like that. And uh, you got a folder, but it's not public yet. You gotta click the folder, and as you can see, what, what it says activity, you go to details, and uh, where it says sharing right here, you edit it on this pencil. And this will show and here right here where it says private only you can access you can you change it you change it to public on the web and BAM just like that you got a public folder now how do you know that well wait this is not public yet nope okay oh yeah there it is as you can see the public folders have that little guy above the folder I'll show you little guy <laughs> anyways so you got a folder now what you have to, what do you have to do you gotta put the files here what files all the files that were in that folder the, both the HTML and the unity 3d file so you select them both open upload and share and they both will be uploaded to the the folder that you've created there's only one last step you click on the your game dot html file not the unity actually you do not click it you do not click it you click on the box not the game not the title the box the place where it is and uh, where it says activity you click the other tab details and it goes to that tab now, as you can see, there's all this thing, and you scroll down 
to where it says hosting and you will click the link that link and ta ta here it is your game my game and uh, just like it did in the other version in the other place it works just like like this <laughs> just the same way and then um, well how do you do to share it to share it you simply copy and paste this and hey friends hello you go to Facebook oh my god friends show the, show my game oh my god so awesome yeah you basically copy oops you basically copy this link right here and um, you're done for life son huh. so yeah I think that's it hope you publish many games care to link them I'd like to see some examples of that <laughs> and um, care to check this guy's post because without it I couldn't even do the tutorial <laughs>